today we've got some Paradise uh, Vapes coming to you. Paradise Vapes right from our own neck of the woods right here in and around the Toronto area. Um, you can get Paradise Vapes on canvape.com. You can order it on their uh, website for about seven bucks for a 10 mil bottle or 14 bucks for a 30 milliliter bottle. Uh, they come in 0, 06, 12, 18, and 24 milligram per milliliter nicotine strengths. Okay some decent vapes. Um, let me talk to you about some of the vapes that I've had. Do you mind if I have a pull off of this one? This is tiger tail juice. I'm vaping in the Aspire Nautilus. This Aspire Nautilus is a awesome tank. Sigeli Mech Mod. Um, tiger tail. Tiger Tail is exactly like the ice cream and it reminds me of being a kid like when my mom would buy Tiger Tail ice cream the orange ice cream with the licorice swirl in it um, and it's it's spot on it's bang on it's so good um, Tiger Tail if you like that ice cream you will like this vape I guarantee fucking it check it out Oh yeah, it is so good. Um, let me talk about this one. Peyote Sky. They don't even have this on the website anymore. And uh, when I first got it, it's, it's a chocolate and like fruity vape mixed together. But when I got it, I thought it was going to be like peyote buttons in there. And I was just going to be howling at the moon with the coyotes and laying in a field underneath a bunch of trees until the roots of the fucking trees start just trying to eat me and fucking hold me down and I'm freaking out and I need a hug and don't fucking touch me, get away from me. Ah. But I didn't get that at all. It was just like a chocolatey fruit vape. Um, and, and out of the bottle, the first time I vaped it, awful. It tasted like puking up chocolate. It tasted like chocolate vomit. But I let it steep. I let it steep the first time for about a month. And it was actually a pretty complex juice. It was pretty complex. Um, and those fruity and chocolatey notes kind of came together. And it was a good vape. I just got three, 30 milliliters of this to kind of sit on for a little bit. And hit up here and there when I need to switch it up. Um, but yeah, they, they don't make that one anymore, so you don't have to worry about it. Um, oh, Tiger Tail, very good. Um, another one that is a very good is this one. Cinnamon Danish, this is an 18 milligram. Um, got this in the mini pro tank on the VTR. Um, and I got a bad coil, like it's just reading wrong, like there's a short in it. Man, I hate pro tanks. 2.9. It was just 2.6. It was 2.3 a minute ago. Okay, I'm going to tune this down so it doesn't burn. <sighs> Cinnamon Danish is like a cinnamon Danish. It's like a sweet cinnamony... Uh, cinnamon roll and it's a super nice vape first time I wasn't really into it I went to the uh, 400 flea market talked to John who works at can vape and I was buying some e-liquid and I said oh well you know I've got two may I'll get one more uh, what do you think I should get and he's like oh get get the cinnamon get the cinnamon Danish and I'm like eh, not so much I'm not a big fan of cinnamon I don't really dig it so much and whatever but I got it, I took it home, and I vaped it. I put it in a in an EVOD at the time. And man, it was really, really fucking good. Like, it was so good. Um, do yourself a favor, try the Cinnamon Danish. Um, another one that is just a super banger is, uh, in my opinion, right? Because, you know, taste is subjective. You might not like what I like. I might not like what you like. But I like this Key Lime Pie. 
or key lime, sorry, it's not pie, it's just key lime, but it's supposed to taste like key lime pie, like the key lime filling with the graham cracker crust. Um, I don't really get the graham cracker crust so much, but I do get the, the filling part, the key lime part. Um, when I first vaped this, I had it in a mini Vivi Nova, um, and I had like a, a coil in it. Uh, it was like a 2.8 ohm coil, and uh, it worked so good. It, it had this great warm vape. It was a sweet vape. I vaped this all day. This was my all day vape for a little while. I went through a lot of this. Um, I took a break from it for a while, but I, ju I just went back to it. I grabbed a couple of bottles, and it is really good. It's a, it's a nice citrusy vape. Um, if you're into citrusy type vapes, or you think you might be, try the Key Lime out. It's good. Another decent uh, citrusy paradise vape is uh, Electric Lemonade. Same type of idea as the Key Lime, but it's more lemon as opposed to the lime. But uh, yeah, another nice sweet citrusy vape to try out. Um, mango. Whoa, 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 wango, whoa, whoa, wow, whoa, wow, whoa, 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 mango, whoa, whoa. This is good. This is like, you know, fresh peeled mango. It's not like a candy mango. It's a, it's a real, real fruit like mango. Um, it's great. This is a great vape. Um, right now it's winter time. It's kind of cold. I'm not too into having, you know, a tropical vape right now. I'd rather have like, you know, meat and potatoes. I'd rather have a meatloaf vape or spaghetti, like a comfort thing, some cinnamon Danish, you know what I mean? But when the nice weather kicks in again, I'm going to be on the mango, wow, wow, and the key lime, and I'm going to be grooving it, Paradise Vapes. Uh, I have to say one thing about the mango. It kind of does linger in your tank. Like, let's say you're using an EVOD or a Pro Tank, and you wash that tank out, you're going between juices. So you wash it out, put it in the sink, rinse it under lukewarm water, whatever. Um, I find that it lingers, like it just finds somewhere to, to stay, and it just dwells there. Like if you have O-rings in your uh, Pro Tanks, It'll kind of just leave like this little re residual flavor in there that might, you know, seep into the next juice you put into it um, or into the coil itself. Like it's like you cannot clean it well enough to get rid of it. Um, I've never put my my tank parts or any of my, my coils in vodka like some people do. Maybe that would work. But, uh, yeah, I've never done that. Um, I just have, you know, one tank that was dedicated to it or, like, a coil that's dedicated to it, and it's groovy. Like, it's a good-tasting vape. Um, another one I've been vaping a lot is Smurfette's Goo. Um, I didn't think that I would like this at first. I thought it would be kind of like Smurfette's Goo. Like, it's kind of a hokey name, right? Like, it's uh, like a catchphrase or something. And uh, I didn't think I'd like it. And, that you know, the description on the website says, you know, like, freshly picked Smurf berries. Like, what the fuck is a Smurf berry, anyway? But it's like, uh, like some mixed fruit. And uh, it's a really good vape. I've gone through. On the Aspire Nautilus, before I just went to this uh, Tiger Tail, I put, like, four tanks. So four tanks? Wow. This week I've gone through four tanks of Smurfette's goo in this tank and it's been absolutely brilliant like it's so good it's like my 50 50 vape like Smurfette's goo has been my half day vape in the Aspire Nautilus um, using an EVIC for the most part um, really good vape on the Smurfette's goo um, wow cinnamon Danish very good um, butterscotch um, I'm not a huge butterscotch fan, but I bought a bottle and it tasted like, you know, rich, kind of creamy uh, butterscotch. But I'm not a fan of butterscotch. I, I never have been. I've never liked butterscotch candies or anything. But I gave it to a lady um, that I work with and she vaped, you know, all of it. <laughs> I gave her like a, you know, a bottle, said, here, try this out. And if you like it, you know, rock and roll it, right? 
And she vaped the whole thing. She's like, oh, it's so good. I love the butterscotch. So it might be something you might like. Um, another one is Martha Strawberry. What is this? Martha Strawberry Swirl Ice Cream. Um, this tastes like what it says it is. It's, you know, strawberry ice cream. Strawberry Swirl Ice Cream. Um, I'm not a fan of it, but it does taste like what it says it is. Oh, I don't have any of this right now, but I have had it. It's the Strawberry Explosion. It tastes like real strawberries. It is a really nice vape from Paradise Vapes as well. Um, try those out. If I gotta say my favorites... Ooh, yeah. Man, that tiger tail is going down real nice. Um, and it's up there. It's definitely up there. But I gotta say my favorites are... So far, Key Lime, Smurfette's Goo, and Cinnamon Danish. I dig on these ones a lot. Um, check them out. Try them out. If you're disappointed, don't take it out on me. You're probably just wrong. Okay. Um, Paradise Vapes at Can Vape. It's pretty cheap. Um, 10 milliliter bottle, $6.95. And a 30 mil bottle is 14 bucks. It's $13.95. Um, check it out. Quick shipping. All that good stuff. So, uh, Paradise Vapes. Thumbs up, kids. It's the good one. <laughs> good, good vapes. You can check out the site. That'd be cool if I just made that appear right there. Can vape. Anyway, like I always say, butt out, vape up, and breathe easy. Canvape.com, Paradise Vapes, damn good e juice.